Welcome to my channel. We're doing your very cozy okay, uh, read because I was listening to Captain Antony. Do that to me once again. <laughs> Love it, right? The the classics. Yeah, now Aries, we're getting re read to filth, but a classic today for a man like you. We're using, okay, I wish I can afford a table that is closer, okay? Because <laughs> why is it so far? <laughs> you don't need to afford to, you can just bring it. Okay, bring it there. Oh, there you go. Okay, sorry. Finestra Tarot, available at my website, etreadlove.me. New Orleans Oracle Deck, same thing. And Alana Fairchild Divine Circus. This is what's going to be used for your reading. Okay, let's begin. Let's do the New Orleans first. If you're from New Orleans, I'm proud of your tarot or oracle. Sorry. Okay, love the color. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. And if you got a problem with how I read, sadly, it's my channel. <laughs> I don't know how to say that. It's my business, not your problem. <laughs> you got self care and science. Oh, okay. Maybe the signs are telling you to have some self-care day. Mm. When was the last time you took a break? Besides going on a break. Read that in between the line. Mm. Self-care and the signs. Don't wait for your blood pressure to go high until you start taking care of yourself. Don't wait for you to have tummy problems because of the way that you eat food. Don't wait, you know, for you not to be able to wake up the next day because of headaches and migraines because you overwork yourself the day before. Is that me? <laughs> <laughs> Don't wait, okay? Because those are the signs. Once you get those signs, they're telling you that something is going to be checked. Doctors, you know, self-care, you know. Don't wait because alignment is here. Self-care, you got to balance yourself, right? Yes. So it, in life, it's always about balance. Easy for us to say, right? Especially you. You're probably some workaholic trying to provide for, you know, A to Zinc with the family. Mm -hmm. You're the breadwinner. I'm the bread eater. Trust me on that. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So do take some time out for yourself. The signs are telling you right now, okay? Um, look at that. There's some crystals also there. She's looking good and she's an angel. See, it's just refresh. So the iris needs to be refreshed. Let me shuffle this first. Okay, let me see. It doesn't want. I want the tap one. Ah, oh, guess of honor. <laughs> Is you. You're the guess of honor. Is you? That's the, mm -hmm. That's the cover of the tarot. Oh, wow, yeah. So you are the guest of honor. You're someone special. Yes, Aries. Um, go fish. <laughs> Isn't it go fish is like a game or something like that? Go fish. Oh my God, I think it's a game. Okay. It's like a bluff. Mm -hmm. But you are a guest of honor. You are go fish. I feel like you are encouraged right now to see other people, to meet other people. Okay. If it's, you know, if it's permitted in your country or where you're at. Um, I feel like the fish, it's like find your own luck, find your own rhythm, okay? Find a balance in your life. And the guest of honor here, I feel like instead of making p other people important, look at yourself also like, I'm a person, I'm important. <laughs> you see that? Mm. Don't be just a self-sacrificial lamb for the many, yes? Okay. So now let's begin here. Let me see. Mm -mm -mm. The Aries. Last time you were missing someone. I know that. Mm. Heard that, Sal. I know. 
Do that to me once again. <laughs> There we go. You got five of wands. Trouble in paradise. Conflict arises. Difference in opinion. He said, she said. And it goes on for days and forever. Relationship for me shouldn't have no issue with regards to opinions. It should be separate, I feel. What you think of them and how they think of you should never come in between the two of you. Because those are perception. And, you know, when we try to perceive something that we do not know, then we use our judgment and then we use that. That becomes conflict. Let me show you how it works. Um, let's just say here, right? I'll be judge as someone who's happy-go-lucky, easy reader, Sally person, sell stuff and everything. But there is a reason for all of those, right? So um, we cannot judge, basically, on just what we see, okay? We can never judge, period. Regardless, you see them, you know them, even your parents, your mom, can never, you can never. Because you don't know what is inside, you know? But there, here... Aries, I feel like the two of you are good at judging each other and making things come so complicated. Five of Wands. And Eight of Wands. I feel like um, there are times where you wanted to make things situation make the situation go. Like, I want this now. This is how it's going to go. And then they would say, it's like, no, I can't do this right now. You know, so there has been some cancellation of dates and plans. There has been some pe sometimes like the, the the person changed their mind, and it gets to you, okay. Um, it feels like someone's got hurt, someone's feelings got hurt, and they left you. Mm -hmm. I don't see this as you leaving them. It's more of you being left. You know, I, I feel like in the dark. They just didn't work it with you. You see that? This person is quick to give up and just to bounce. Okay. You have the Knight of Cups. Um, you're still saying sorry for this, you know, sorry. Let's make it work. You're extending yourself here. I I see that you're okay, we'll 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 make the we'll we'll fix this. This is what you're telling this person. It's like, but stay, don't go. Okay. You tried to be sweet, you tried to be cuddly, you tried to be that person that, you know, they say probably like, Oh, you changed already. Now you're not like that. First time we were dating, you were still like that. Now you're different. People do change. Mm. King of Pentacles with the Eight of Cups. Um, I feel like this is you persuading them, trying to win them back. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. There's a lot of package coming in. You got a Queen of Swords, okay, which only means that you are really letting go first right now. It's like, listen. Okay, if you say that you're gonna go, and I'm trying here my best to say sorry, because I see here that there are some some tears. You really felt it to your core. Like, listen, you're hurting me. Don't give up on me right now. I'm not. I'm not sure why they're saying that. You know, don't give up on me. Not even don't give up on us. I sense here someone has given up on you, and I'm not. I'm not butchering you, Aries. This is the term that they're using. <coughs> Excuse me. They don't even want to use the don't give up on us. Don't give up on me. But someone just jump and just basically ghosted you now. Five of Pentacles. You haven't heard back from them ever since that they have left. Five of Pentacles with the Eight of Cups. Ever since. And now, of course, because I sense this Queen of Swords right here. If you look closely into her eyes, it feels like she has some sadness. There's been some longing. There's been some wondering. Okay. Like, I wonder what the person is doing. I wonder how, you know, you know what happened? This is what you're asking right now, since there's no contact, no communication. I'm going to continue this reading. Link down there in the description box below for the extended. Thank you very much, Iris, for watching. We'll see where this reading goes. Have a wonderful day. Bye, guys.